Hello, 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 everybody. This is Renault, and today I'm going to do another game of uh, Lords of Waterdeep offline. Uh, I mentioned earlier I'm working to get these instead of the Spelunky uh, daily challenges, just because, like I mentioned before, uh, my Spelunky is a pain in the backside to get to work because of controller issues. Now, during these games, I do like to have some music playing in the background, so let's get some OC Remix started. Now, I want you to know that this is actually, um, what's the name of this uh, OC Remix? Just a second. Hold on. This is information that's surprisingly difficult to find. There it is. It is Kirby's Adventure Double Rain. It's called Double Rainbow. It is a remix of both the uh, Cloud Level and the uh, Dream Cold Dream Level. This is a remix done by Mr. Patrick Burns. Let's see if I can remember to announce every remix. Oh, and by the way, uh, this is remix number two seven five three. So if you like this mix. That's 2753. So how's everybody doing? Thanks so much for tuning in, by the way. I always appreciate you, my audience. Alright. Let's have the uh, computer give us our uh, random stuff. I've got Arcana and Skullduggery. That's... Uh, Rogues and Thieves and Wizards. Let's see, what are my starting quests? None, neither one of these are relevant. That would have been great for last game. That was, I played off stream, but uh, this time not so much. Might be able to utilize this ambush. Nope, I'm not giving the AI any of my money. So, I'm going to be the second to last player. It's the most frequent starting spot for me, I noticed. I'm going to go ahead and grab this right here. Because you can't really go wrong with this. It's, uh, it's one of those... Uh, it takes five wizards, or purple. But, it's worth so many points. So next turn, I'm going to grab a uh, Castle Waterdeep tile. So I can go first next time and make sure I get the ambush off. Uh, today's been a good day. I woke up and didn't do anything. Because I've been just... Uh, you know one of those days where you wake up, but you're feeling tired? That's me all day. Let's get this ambush going. Get some orange dudes. Only two. Alright. Alright, let's go. Yeah, today's been a good day otherwise. Even if I, it's one of those days where I didn't do anything. Sometimes those are the best days. So... Oh yeah, definitely want to grab this Arcana. Because uh, that Arcana is going to give me two additional points for each Arcana quest I complete. So that can be, uh, you know, it, it adds up over time. You know, you complete five Arcana quests, you've gotten ten additional points. And believe me, those ten points can definitely make a difference. Now, since it looks like there's a lot of Arcana out here, I'm going to be grabbing these. I'm grabbing this because it gives me... It's going to give me some additional purples. That's always good as I go closer and closer to that one quest that requires five wizards. Let's see what kind of uh, things we got here. Special assignment. Yep. 
we're definitely going to go on a special assignment on behalf of Clan Wizard. It's going to give me another Arcana quest. It's going to skip everything else until I get an Arcana. Oh, and that's one of the best Arcana missions. Seriously, this actually might be the best mission in the game. It's arguable, arguably, the best mission in the game. I say I keep saying mission when in reality it's quest. Now the reason why that's so good is because it lets me place where someone else has already placed. So that can be a huge boon. Wow, none of this stuff down here is good. Absolutely none of it. But this is going to get me some additional black throughout the game, if any of my the AI go there. So even though it's not going to be that good in and of itself, it's still worth it to grab. I'm glad I have him aggressively pursuing purple. Because that is the second time the AI tried to hit me with an arcane misfortune. Is anybody going to actually go here? No? Well, and that's okay. Nobody went here. That means it's worth more now. And so I have a vested interest in going here and get all those points. Yes, I miss out on the black I could have gotten. But I already missed out on the black I could have gotten. Plus, this is huge, getting four blacks. Let's see, anything else? Nah. Oh, see? Speaking of those blacks being huge, boom, I'm already able to complete that mission. Because it's an economy of turns. Normally, to get four black, I would have to get one of these special houses, or I would have to just go somewhere twice, minimum. So there's not a lot of uh, places to get that many points for the time investment, so it's definitely worth it. Yeah, it's just unfortunate that my, uh, my entry cards are kind of poop. And none of these buildings are worth getting. None of them. They're terrible. So what I'm going to do is just stock up on resources. None of my intrigues are good. And none of these buildings are good. So there's no real incentive to try and expand. I'm going to leave that to the AI to try and expand. And leave it to the AI they do. I could have gotten here and gotten to purple, maybe next time. Hopefully the AI does not uh, take the castle water deep, because I will definitely be going here to grab two purple. And it, as you can see, the purple is normally worth only one. Going here, I can get two purples, but then the AI gets whatever color they want. Speaking of purple, there's a lot of purple that just became available, so I'm going to hit that up. Let's see. So it's usually worth it to get the bigger missions. Because the bigger missions, even though they take a lot of resources, they're worth, uh, you're still um, saving time getting all those, because 20 points. That can be three mission. That can be like three missions, or I keep saying missions, three quests. That can be like three quests. I actually forgot that I had the one purple mission that allows me to land on top of someone else. So I'm going to be consistently getting a lot more two purples on an as-needed basis. Speaking of which, okay, so somebody did go there last turn. So as you can see, both of these are worth 6 points, but the AI and myself both recognize that these buildings are pretty terrible. 
granted, um, so as it is, every two point, two coins is worth one point. And you see these reds down here? These are how many points the buildings are worth. They increase by one every turn. So when you see six here, that means that this building is worth six points to get. And even then, people have been avoiding it. Because this, these two buildings are not really that good. I don't want these buildings because of the resources they give me when the AI goes here. Because when the AI goes here, oh, whoop de doo I'll get uh, entry. Entries are not that great. At least not the ones I've been getting. So whenever the AI goes here or goes here, you get an entry. And that, that entry card is not necessarily going to help you. Whereas if I just straight up give... Go here, for example, take all the oranges, and there's a bunch of orange there. Those oranges are going to help me. Speaking of helping me, it's... Okay, just seeing what kind of colors I need. But basically, it's all coming down to you need a whole lot of purple. Oh, crap. I thought I bought this mission already, but I haven't. But that's okay, it's no big loss. I just need to grab a holy... Or a white. And then I'm good. Speaking of white. Let's go here now. I'm going to grab a white and a purple. See, I forgot to uh, read off that last uh, theme, by the way. But I'm not going to forget this one, because this one's very striking. This is a remix number 1138. It's a remix of Donkey Kong Country 2's uh, Forest Interlude. It's a remix done by uh, someone named Protricity. That's Pro Tri City. Protricity. So, again, I'm probably going to hit up this one every turn. Wow, round seven? I'm actually kind of glad the uh, AI is grabbing these purples. Buildings, even though they're terrible. So I'm going to grab this. Going to give me straight three purples. Not going to move me closer to getting this mission. The one that requires five. Gets me closer to that. see what other purple so I'm probably gonna go here next just to get that one and I'm gonna go here it's a shame that these uh yeah nope I'm not going to give up any of my black. I need those workers. I'm running a plantation out here. Yeah, I'm going to go here and grab a purple and a white. And that'll help me move forward with my next few missions. Purple and white. No... So, I don't have the least amount of points, even though I've only completed four missions. I'm second to last, but that's okay. I'm not, it's, I'm not going to be moved ahead of this person. Let's get rid of... Wow, both of these are kind of terrible. Uh, that guy. I mean, you get that guy if you plan on completing a lot of warfare. And obviously, I am not planning on completing a lot of warfare. But I am going to play this one um, thing here, because I want to slow this guy down a little bit. Or one of these people. So white, black, black. I'm going to go here and see what their resources are. They have no white and no black, black.
Speaking of black, as you can see, it's four here, so I'm probably going to go there as well. Oh, you know what? I can go there and complete this mission. Anyway, hold on, let's check out this other person. So, th hmm. this person has none of the resources required, so I'm going to give this to her, Laurel. Now, the reason why I don't like attacks is because that did not move me forward on anything I needed to do. By the way, you'll notice I was going to get that mission, and then the AI cleared it all out. Because the AI is a jerk. What I'm going to do is go here. Mostly for the purple, but it also gets me a little bit of orange. See? Now it allows it to get easier to complete these. But I want to make sure I complete this before I complete this. Actually, you know what? Let's complete this now. Because I can still get the two purple. I have, I have the white, the black. I just need the two purple. So yeah. Completing that mission was actually the better choice. Wait a minute. What the hell? Did I accidentally put my guy there? Oh, crap. Oh, man. I've been kind of in a haze a little bit. I think I might have accidentally put my guy here. Does that mean? Yeah. Crap. I'm going to get my two purple. Oh, I can go here. I just need to be careful. Yeah, that was completely and totally an accident. I wasn't paying attention. Although that does mean pretty much that I'm not going to be able to complete the Skullduggery mission. So I need... <coughs> When all said and done, you still want to make sure. Well, come on. Why can't I complete this mission? Oh, money. Oh! Wow, it's like the AI saw me say that I needed the money, and then they went there, so I couldn't get the money. Oh, boy. That's pretty aggravating. That is really aggravating. But that's what I get. I wasn't paying attention. I did not have to go here. I could have gone here. And then I could have placed my guy here to get the additional purple. But I am screwed now because I just needed the money. That's all I needed. <sighs> well, no point in continuing to cry about it. Ew! I just did this one. By the way, this is OC Remix number 885. And the reason why I said ew is because we really did just listen to this song. So my remixer is jacked up somewhere. I gotta find out um, where this song is listed. Just a second. Yeah, we are not listening to this again. That just means I need to curate my remix list. <sighs> oh. If I had gotten those additional 20 points, I would have 108, and I probably would have won. But instead, I only had 88. Yeah, I would have won. But instead, I came in third, fourth, fifth. Oh, I came in last. Because of my foolishness, I came in last place. And last place is what I deserved because I wasn't paying attention. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. This was Reno playing Lords of the Waterdeep. Bye-bye.